I had been with uh, Bill Monroe in 63, 1963, and a promoter by the name of Carlton Haney was in uh, North Carolina there. And he, he told Bill, he said, you know, we should have a bluegrass festival, you know. There had never been one. And, but Bill didn't agree with him, but by 1967, you know, he did agree with him, and I thought, you know, that's it a great is a idea. Distinct honor and pride to introduce to you our man of the and weekend. And I would like to have one myself. Our host band of the weekend. That was the first time I think I ever thought and about having a festival hearts, of my own. Ronnie, Robbie, Jason, Allen, and Father Dell, the Dell McCurry Band. <laughs> Delfest, I think, it's it's not strictly a bluegrass festival. We book uh, string bands, actually, you know, and and it encompasses a lot of different forms of music, actually. We're gonna ride, we're gonna ride. We have bluegrass bands, and we have jam bands, and the bluegrass fans, you know, they get to see the jam bands, and, and the jam fans, they get to see bluegrass, maybe for the first time, you know. And and so it's, it's kind of a uh, variety of music. <laughs> we have a lot of folks that are teenagers, and we have them all the way up to my age, which is getting up there, you know. <laughs> but we have a wide spectrum of fans, and they all enjoy themselves there. We're looking forward to having a lot of late night playing, you know, for folks that want to stay up late. Now, some folks want to go to bed early, and they can because where we have the late night is inside, and it don't bother the folks that want to sleep. We're looking forward to seeing folks at the Memorial Day Weekend Bell Fest this year. <laughs>